I've got this burlap. And of course, you know, we've got to start and use this stuff we've got in. If anybody wants this, it'll be in the shop later. I'm just going to cut a piece off. Um, so I'm going to cover this one. Um, no, I'm not. I wasn't going to do that, silly old. Take a paper cup. These are really, really easy projects. And we're going to be covering these. Yeah. So, let's just... Cut a piece off. I'm going to make sure that it's covered. Make sure. I'm just going to wait for the glue gun. Sorry, I should have done that first. Now, the same goes with these. You know, we can cover these like that. Never waste that because that'll make a flower or a leaf. And we just have to make sure that they are covered and then we cut round them. So we'll be doing that as well. Uh, and these are so easy, these uh, craft projects. I'm just going to make sure that this, like I say, is uh, covered. Like that. And I'm gonna, I've got two of them. So you need two polystyrene cups, plastic cups, whatever it is you're using. Um, and like I say, we just wait for the glue. Okay, okay, let's just get this straight. That has to be straight for me. <laughs> so I'm just going to cut this there. Doesn't matter about that seam at the back at all. that in we will be able to trim this off I'm going to try and trim it oh, a bit leveler than that more level than that should I say that should do I'll clear your rubbish as you go along right what we need to do now is to trim that Now we need to also put a hole in the top and I need some other string which is the one I was using earlier. Let me just use a pin. I might be able to do it using a pin. I'm going to fold it in half and half again. So I've used about a metre. Right. And I'm just going to see if I can pop that through there. Now, I'm going to do it this way, I think. Yeah, wait a minute. And make that a little bit bigger. Where's my? Oh, this is going to melt it a little bit with the heat. Just thread that through. Let me get my. Just push it through. That's it. 
Now I've left it long enough because I've used a meter. I don't think it all went through though, did it? No. No, did it hell. That did. We just need them the same. And we're going to tie a knot in there. Now, I have to put the glue onto the knot and pull that back through like that. And that secured that. And then what we do is I'm just gluing that down and overlap them. So one, two, three, like that. Let's overlap them. When you're working with polystyrene you do have to remember the heat will melt it so it's better to work quickly with it let's just help oh holding that down push that back in now all we need to do is we're going to cut up the rim around there as well leaving about a centimeter And make a pair of these, this is what you need to do. So again, snipping them. Uh, once again, I'll do the same there work around and tuck that in sometimes you have to hold it in with it being like I said being polystyrene you need to make sure you've got enough glue to hold it down Really quick and easy projects and fun. And we've more or less made like um, a bell, which is what I intended to do. So I'll just get rid of those bits. Don't get rid of that, it can make a leaf. Even that can make a leaf. I can say I waste nothing. So I need to do two of those. So, oh, I didn't do the middle bit, but that's not, not a problem. I can still do it there. So, I'm going to pinprick that in the middle. I'm going to open that up a bit more using the hot glue nib. Take the string, make sure we've got enough to double. Well, 
like that you don't you're not going to see it doesn't matter so we'll do this one as well just in case we have the same accident with that so just leave those two to dry <coughs> and then what i'm going to do while i'm at it i'm also going to use my scraps to cover the egg um let me just see which bit i need no i'm not going to use the yes i will well i hang on we'll use that bit first Pop that on top. Like that. And you'll see what I'm doing. Take that off. Get rid of the rubbish. I don't want any of that yet. Now we're just going to cover the top with this. So basically I'm going to go from the top over like that and around the edge like that and then reverse that. And you've got to just because it's fabric you have to ease it on like that might have needed to move that a little bit actually let's just try and move that there that's better just move it about where you want it You need an edge, a little edge like that. And then what I'm going to do is trim that. Okay. And we've got to do the same thing. We're going to snip it around the edge. Again, cover that over. just to tidy that up so you can't see the base and then hopefully if my light is working I think the other one is Well, of course it's not. We'll do that afterwards. Just singe that round. Or put some clear glue round it. But there you go. So, we've got that far. Now, oh. Now what I've got to do is to make two little ears. And I want... Whoops, a daisy. Where's my other wire? Let me just get another wire. So what I'm going to do is cut this just cut it in a horseshoe 
Like that. <laughs> I'm going to hold on to that bit. Now, I'm going to pull them in like that. And pull that in as well. Like that. Um, pop them onto here. Like that. Do you know what? I don't think I'm going to need to. I think I'll just fold that over like that. That'll do. That'll do. Fold that over like that. And basically, you just have to, because that's glued in now, it should be okay. And you just have to follow around like that. So you've got that. I'll do the same again with this one. That's not quite. Make sure they're roughly the same size. It's just my um, Inca Gold. And of course, well, it's not working that well, but it should do what I need. That's it. It needs to be a little bit wetter than what it is, but it'll do. It's done what I wanted it to do. For now. Now, what we have to do is we slice, I'm going to put, yeah, let's just see if we can get these done. them forward a little bit that's moving about come on mate you can go there and I take my little pins that's it he looks cute these are little black pins and they're great for eyes and things like that now because it's going to be an ornament I can just sit that in there like that hopefully we can get these to go in little bit big but never mind they'll be fine Like that. 
and it has to have a little tiny pink nose. Well, he can have a little tiny pink nose. I've got a lip, uh, some small pink beads. Right on the end, we're going to give him a little nose. There you go. Last thing to do is his tail. And for that, I'm going to need... This has got something to do with these... Um, things so don't worry it is all part and parcel of it so I've got this which is quite firm um, uh, wire do it that way feet right-handed mate right So we're just going to do this with his tail. We'll just do that. That's make sure that it stays on. little bit more. They have nice long tails don't they? Like that. And this is where it gets awkward because you have to snip this. There we go. And what I'm going to do is just to strengthen this one is to run this back a little bit because um, it's a little bit thicker near the back side, isn't it, compared to the rest. And I want to make sure that we've got that right. There we go. And you're thinking, poor tail, it's straight for now. Okay, but we're going to bend that and bend that back. Let me get these and bend it back again, like that. And then what you do is, uh, I can use, I probably could use this just to stick his tail in there like that there you go look and we've made a little mouse aren't they cute just cute cute as anything <laughs> There you go. That's just bits of wire. So, I've got my mouse. Um, <coughs> now all I've got to do is to decorate one of these. So on the top, right, we'll keep that long. On the top, I'm gonna to put some of these decorations on.
so much nicer when you spend a little bit of time. Look at that, isn't that gorgeous? <clears throat> well, I've got the seam at the front. Uh. <laughs> now, so we'll have to remedy that. And uh, let's, I don't know, shall we put that at the front? No, too much. Too much. Well, I suppose we could just have one of them. Oh, yes, yeah, just that there. Don't need any more than that. To hide that seam. I don't know why I did that at the front, but hey ho, never mind. We can correct that now. And that all matches. It's quite pretty, isn't it? But what we've got to do, and I'm going to do it, is this. We need to... I need the white paint as well. Oh, I've got the white paint there. Right, so let me just clear some of this. That one's done. I'm going to finish this one first before I do the next bit. Now, do I have any more bells? I think I did. I don't know where it is. But then they don't all have to have one. Now, the reason why I did the mouse was, and it probably could have done with being a little bit smaller. But I like him as is. It's because he's going to be walking like that on the side of one or resting now I'm going to have him on this one and he's going to go like that because it's just something different And what did I have in there? Oh, some of those purple flowers. I wonder what that nice bright colour was. So we're going to not have that one. I don't like that one. I'm going to do the same here. Get some of that colour in there. Oh, I love it. I love it. Absolutely love it. <laughs> Just do. It's good. It's, uh, I love them. Look. Now what we've got to do, which I've got to clear all of this. I might put those in there, actually. Let's just have a look. Yes, I think I will. I think I'm going to put these in the front. Jo He's going up for the berries. Of course he is. Yeah, love that look. So now we've got the pair, but we've got to put the um, other bits inside, which are these. Let me just move all of that and I can clean up later. I just clean it all up. Oh, there's a berry there that can go in that. There. 
that'll do not fussed so what I've got to do now is to make sure that these are all on um, string now I do have some string ready and all you do is you've got the stalk you get a little bit of glue move that move it out of the way and you wrap around the stalk just twist it round there's one and just leave that to dry now let's see hey <laughs> and you've got little like bells 